An event to mark the World Cities Day took place today at the Apegama premises in Patramulla and the auspices of President Maitri Parasethi Sena. <laughs> World Cities Day is aimed at finding solutions to the housing issues faced by the communities the world over and form a process to embellish cities through sustainable development. Better development and better aspects for the country are created and distributed from the cities. There is another side to this as well. That is harmful aspects such as drugs and various other diseases, sexually transmitted diseases such as HIV is also spread from the cities. That is the situation in Sri Lanka. Development of a city does not mean embellishment alone. On the day we mark World Cities Day, we need to understand and move with the concept of a better life with a better city. Under this theme, we all have responsibilities. As a new government, we have established the Ministry of Megapolis and Western Development. This ministry was established in order to fulfill this task for the future of the country. When the late President Jai Vardhana moved the administrative capital to Kote, it only took 15 minutes to go to Kote from the presidential palace. Today it takes an hour and a half for that journey. At a time when the President and Prime Minister are operating offices in Kolpiti, there is an issue with regard to travelling to the institutions of administration and public service. We need a better program to address this. I believe that we have provided a streamlined national plan and hope that it will be implemented in the future. The construction of the road in Pulduwa Udumulla to make the transport system of the economic capital of Sri Javadanapur Kote more efficient commenced today under the patronage of President Maitri Palasi Risena. The project, jointly carried out by the Urban Development Authority and Road Development Authority, is done at a cost of 316 million rupees.